Reading and writing numbers to 100. In this nugget, we're going to be reading and writing numbers up to 100 in numerals and words. First, we just need to recap the numbers 1 to 9. So, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. We have the numerals on the top and the words underneath. Once you've mastered the spellings of these words, it will be much easier to spell numbers above 20. Now's the time to check that you can spell these nine numbers. You may want to write them down. Pause the video now and have a quick practice. How did you get on? Now let's take a quick look at the numbers 10 to 19. Can you remember how to spell all of these numbers? It's now time to check. Pause the video if you need to. OK, so now you've mastered 1 to 19, we're going to move on to numbers between 20 and 100. That's a lot of numbers, but don't worry, if you can already spell 1 to 9, all you need to do is practice spelling the multiples of 10. Here we have 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80 and 90. Do you notice that they all end in TY? The multiple of 10 that you need to watch out for is 40. It's easy for people to think that it's the number 4 with TY on the end. But this is wrong. There is no U in 40. Now if you can spell all of these multiples of 10 and the numbers 1 to 9, then you will be able to spell every number from 20 to 100. Pause the video and practice spelling these multiples of 10. OK, so now we're ready to spell any number up to 100. Let's start with this number. This number has two tens, so it's going to start with 20. It has nine ones. So it's going to end in 9. So this number is 29. Now 29 is one word, but it's a hyphenated word. This is a hyphen. It goes between two words that join together to make one word. When a word is hyphenated, there are no spaces between each word and the hyphen. Now let's look at this number. It has five tens, so it will start with 50. And it has eight ones, so it will end in eight. Now we join it all together with a hyphen and we get 58. Now it's your go. Have a go at writing these numbers in words. Pause the video and have a go. Well done if you got 31, 46, 87 and 93. Did you spell them all correctly? And did you remember the hyphens? Well done if you did. So remember, to write the numbers up to 100, you need to be able to write the multiples of 10 and the numbers 1 to 9. When you're joining two parts of a number together, don't forget the hyphen.